Alright, what's going on YouTube? Rack 718 back with another video. And I'm very excited to share this uh, comic haul with you actually. This was the second day. This was the next day actually of a weekend Comic Con. Uh, small Comic Con, nothing big, just something uh, local. Uh, but this was the second day um, of the Comic Con. Uh, different Comic Con. So I wanted to... Um, if you watched my last video, that was Saturday, and this is Sunday, and you can see a little bit on the side of the camera of kind of what I picked up. I'm going to try to go through this as fast as I can, but uh, this is probably the most I've picked up. I believe these were 50 cents. I mean, the, the dealer just had like 100 long boxes, and these are just back and boards. I always try to carry extras when I can. Um... So I'll try to go this as fast as I can, but um, I'm very happy to pick up some of these. Some of these I've never, never seen before, like this one, this Star Wars Legacy 48. Uh, you know, usually I just pick up anything that's Star Wars, and then when I get home, I decide, you know, I look at, see what the, what the comic book about. But this is like a $50, $60 book if you can find it. Again, everything in this short box was like 50 cents. But this is the first appearance of Darth Havoc, I guess is that character there. Um, but if you can find it, it's the first appearance. Uh, it's definitely getting some buzz, it looks like. And it's selling for, you know, 50, 60, 80 dollars. So if you can find that. Um, another book that I found, and I've never had this in my collection, was this... Star Wars Mace Windu number five. Now this is another fifty, sixty dollar book. This is the first appearance of uh, Ahsoka in Marvel canon. So I know that other Star Wars book is getting a lot of hype, but this is, I guess, her first appearance in canon. So definitely worth uh, getting in the collection. Found another copy of One Punch Man, first appearance, I believe, in Marvel Comics. I believe he appeared in Magma Comics, but uh, first appearance in maybe American Comics. I found a bunch of, uh, let me see if I can just lay it flat, maybe. Because a lot of these are raw. And I uh, haven't had a chance to back and board them, so I found a bunch of these... Um, these cannons. Let me see if I can focus a little bit. Found a bunch of these uh, Star Wars cannon. Uh, cannon, Conan, the last Padawan. Cannon, the last Padawan. So I found four, three, two, three, five, seven, eight. Nine and eleven. So I believe it was a twelve issue series, fourteen or something like that. So I got a good bulk of the collection here. But even these scattered issues are selling for something online. So if you can find these, just just pick them up. You know, of course, the key issue is number one. I believe there's some other issues in the middle that are keys, but. If you can pick up these random issues and kind of get a broken set together, you never know uh, what other collectors looking for that. So I found those. That was a separate dealer, so I think those were dollars. Dollar. I found some of these Air Force Ones. Air Force, uh, A Force, sorry. A Force number one, two, uh, three, and four. So a different uh, different volume from some of the, I think this is the most recent A-Force. Um, so I'm not sure, uh, I believe it's the second volume, but 2016. So I picked these up um, for 50 cent. I found another copy of the Black. Uh, very controversial series. I believe this got optioned. This is the finale, chapter 6 of a 6 issue series. So... If you can find any copy, definitely worth picking up. I mean, it's very hard to find those. And look at this. I found a bunch of these Bitter Roots. Bitter Root 2. Bitter Root 3. 
believe these are cover A's. Bitterroot 4. Another cover for Bitterroot 4. And Bitterroot 5. So those are covers I've never seen before. I have one. Uh, but I don't ha I have one and two, but I don't have these later issues. So um, very nice to find those. I'm not sure why I picked this up, but this is like a short series Black Widow. Um, two, three, four, five, and six. So I'm missing number one. So this is a six issue mini series. Uh, Black Widow, the things they say about about her. So I'm missing number one. So you know from my past videos, I try to collect the short mini series. I don't mind collecting those. So I got that. I found another uh, black badge. This is number one. So I believe this got option two from Boom Studio. So I got a bunch of these and I found another number one. So it doesn't hurt to get a copy of that. Right, I'm not sure what this is. This was a virgin cover of the black. Oh, this is number two, a virgin cover. This is pretty cool. So, found that. Found issue five of A-Force number one. Or A-Force number five, sorry. Number five, issue five. And I had to look this up. Usually I don't use my phone when I'm digging, man, because... Um, I try to kind of know what you're looking for, but this black is from the same, uh, it's from Black Mass. Let me see, it's the same people from the other black, I believe. I believe it's from the same people, Lit, Robinson, Sharp. Yes, the same people, Lit, Robinson, and Sharp. It's the same people. When I looked this up, it was black and AF is as fuck, I guess. I'm not sure, but black AF, widows and orphans. Oh, I do got number one, black widow number one. Okay. So I got the full miniseries, one through six. I forgot about that. So I got that. I got a couple issues of black here. I got Excellence number three from Image Comics. That came out a while ago. I got some more black badge, it looks like, number two. So I got one and then a one virgin cover and then a couple copies of issue two. Looks like I got a bunch of black badge, issue three. From Boom Studios and Boom Studios, man, that's, that's hot. Pearl, I got Pearl number three. That's a hot series. I got another bitter root. Now this is a hot cover. I got another bitter root number five. I got Coyote number one first print. There was a second print to that cover. I remember that. Dark Avengers number four. That set is 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 very hot right now. Dark Avengers number five, and I believe I have one, two, and three already. Uh, Daredevil 323, just a hot cover right there, a Venomized cover. Every time I see that, I, I try to pick it up. Excellence number one, I believe that's the cover A. Found another copy of Excellence number one. I like the maybe cover B of Excellence number one. Issue two, two copies of issue two. So yeah, this, this dealer had a bunch of independent comics, it looks like. Pearl number, this is Pearl number one cover B, I believe. And then this is Pearl number one cover A. So yeah, he had a bunch of independent titles, as you can see. And I was just stacking up on all of these. Excellence number four, God of War number one. That's like the newer volume, so it's not the original two and three. Then I was surprised to see this. New X-Men 129, I believe it's the first full Phantom X. Another Pearl 2. So I got a nice little set of Pearl comics. Pearl number 3. Another Pearl number 3. 
Yeah, a couple issues on number four. Another issue on number four. Hot Hot Series number five. I believe this got options, so you never know what could happen with that series. Pearl number six. I got one through six, it looks like. I never had this cover, number seven. Number eight. Another issue of number eight, different cover. Pearl number one, another cover for number one. Then I got some Secret Avengers 4. Two copies of Secret Avengers 4. Another copy of Pearl number 1. Now that came out a long time ago, so I'm surprised he still had number 1s in the 50 cent bin. Shirtless Bear Fighter number 2, the second print. Just a funny series. Found some more Mace Windu number 1. Another issue of number 1. So as you can see, I was just picking all these up. X-Force 27. I believe I got it, yeah, because of this. X-Force 26, first appearance of the Omega Core, I believe it is. Another copy of X-Force 26. And I was surprised to find this. Truth number two. Another copy of Truth number two. Copy of Truth number three. And then I don't know, this uh, Wolverine Old Man Logan 66, the third print. I've never, never seen this before, the third print. So that was kind of interesting. And then this is 67, the second print. And then I found more copies of Word number one, I believe that got option from Dark Horse. Word number one, cover B. Number three and number two, Word. So I got like a nice little set of that. Uh, word number three, Word number four, Word number four. That's a crazy cover right there. I don't know why I got this, man. That cover is kind of messed up. That's like a... I don't know why I got that, but that's just a cool cover right there. And then... Uh, 451 and 450, first time X-23 joins the X-Men, or he, they battle, I guess. So yeah, that's... Uh, and then the rest of these are just backboards, more backboards. So yeah, man, crazy haul, as you can see, crazy haul. A um, lot of comic books I got to get to as far as backing and boarding and kind of seeing what I want to do with these. I'm pressing a lot of these books myself now. So, you know, some of these, sometimes the condition doesn't matter to me. I'll just take it home and practice pressing it. So that's kind of what I'm doing now. But yeah, man, I'm definitely happy to get these, man. These are some cool pickups right here. All of these are good pickups, man. I'm glad I'm... Glad I was there. So yeah, uh, let me know what you're picking up out there. That's all I have. Thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting. Please subscribe to the channel. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. And uh, let me know what you're picking up. Definitely always good to hear what you guys are picking up out there. And as always, collect what you want to collect. But please take care of those comics. And I'll talk to you later.